think they asked me if it was me and I was like, why would it be me? Like, why would I talk about myself? What's up? What, what it do? What's good? What's poppin'? What's going on? Ooh. <laughs> Before we start today's video, please feel free to like, subscribe, and comment. And that's all right. Go play. OMG, Lord, please take me now. Are you good? Are you good? Gosh. Disrespectful. Also, feel free to check out my Instagram account because if I am not posting here, then I'm most definitely posting on there. I always do skits. I always just post polls and stuff like that, and my polls are pretty popular. A lot of people like, oh, I was like, you should totally check it out. <laughs> today, check it out. <laughs> so, today's video is going to be about the time that I hacked my best friend's. Instagram account basically this story took place in seventh grade middle school and this best friend we're gonna call her Amelia and there was another best friend we're gonna call her Layla okay we're gonna call her Layla it was just three of us that little friend circle we were all pretty close because we had I guess a lot of the same classes together anyways but me and Amelia I'm pretty sure like flat out the same schedule yeah only one different class but all of our classes were the same so it's like you know we might as well be cool we might as well talk we might as well be best friends and yeah yeah me and Amelia we rarely argued yeah we rarely argued we were just pretty close it was just always fun games whatever whatever we would just talk to them. Like I guess when I finally started seeing how Amelia really was like the kind of person she really was that started backing off and I guess that was one of the things that influenced my decision into hacking her page and I'm gonna give you examples of her there was this time where I spoke to Amelia about how I was feeling because I guess I was pretty down in middle school i would say like feel depressed sometimes because i was getting bullied like a lot i was getting bullied because i'm haitian dark skin you know back then it was rough okay and being dark sooner at, at that it's still rough okay it's still rough you always see this kind of post like oh light skins this dark skins this you know what i'm saying it's just always some bullcrap dealing with dark skins and then we always getting guests lit and stuff like that you know what i'm saying literally yeah so dang what i was talking about I forgot but yeah I guess there was this time where I spoke to Amelia about how I felt and then she threw it in my face one time she was like well you da -da 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 and I was like oh, I see every time that I will tell her who I had a crush on there came to a point where I just stopped telling her who I had a crush on right every single time that I told her I had a crush on somebody she would then say she had a crush on a person and then try to pursue that exact person I said I had a crush on Ryan. All of a sudden, she goes trying to walk him home. She learned his periods. She learned every single class that he had and would wait outside. But Ryan liked me, right? And I guess I could kind of tell that he liked me, but I didn't really, I wasn't really able to tell to like wait after I left the school anyway. That's how it always go down. I hate that. If you like me, tell me now. Tell me now. Don't wait till school's over. I don't know why dudes do that. And then there was this other dude named Andrew, right? These are fake names, by the way, okay? Andrew had locks. I think Andrew was mixed. I don't know what he was. Maybe he... He probably just super light-skinned. He probably... No, I think he was mixed. Yeah, I think he was Hispanic. Like, I, I don't know. But I, Andrew was something. It doesn't really matter. I don't even know why I'm focusing on it. Whatever. So I said I had a crush on Andrew. All of a sudden, she comes to our class and tries to show her butt to Andrew. Not like, you know, flash or whatever, but she's like, the way she's standing. This is seventh grade, okay? You know how girls be. You know how everybody lift the pants up, da -da -da, just walk in front of him. <laughs> hey, Andrew. <laughs> and I'm just like, okay. I'm really not gonna fight it. I'm really not gonna fight the situation because seventh grade, man insecure. I know I probably don't have a chance with this person anyways. I don't care. So I really can't do nothing about it. <laughs> Another way that I started seeing how she was, she would talk about our friend Layla. She would talk about our other friend Destiny, whatever. When Destiny <laughs> mom had, you know, cut her eyebrows. I'll tell you, Millie was really having a field day <laughs> with that subject. And I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna front. I did make a comment and then I let it go after that. I didn't think that's our friend. I'm not gonna trip. Okay. Basically, long story short, Millie is fake. 
Millie was fake. So I guess the last straw for me was when we went to this little field trip. It was uh, Layla, Amelia, and me. We went to this little computer room trying to do something for a scholarship on the computer, whatever. And uh, Layla was telling me that Amelia was talking about me. And I'm like, and then she would tell me exactly what Amelia said. And I was like, oh, okay. I guess just inside I was just looking for a reason to cut Amelia off anyways because I really didn't have to hack her page but I guess I was just tired of her talking about people that's why I hacked her page I think that really was it and I know Layla could have been lying but you know they both were fake I'm not gonna front they both were pretty fake I'm pretty sure they were talking about me because they would tell me what each other said so I had to be in a mix at the end of the day at the other end so I wasn't entertaining it too much in a way but I wasn't entertaining it too much <laughs> so basically seventh grade year was gonna be my last year at that middle school because I was moving i moved a lot i moved a lot <laughs> my school year after that day at the computer room whatever millie had given me her um instagram and stuff like that why i don't know why she gave it to me i guess i was just like oh let me hack because it's something 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 i don't know what i really should have known was just deactivating her account because hacking was unnecessary <laughs> i should just deactivated it the way i hacked it was i put everything that she said about people in her bio so what she said about layla i put what she said about layla in her bio what she said about destiny i put what she said about destiny in her bio every single person and i put what she said about me in her bio i thought it was so slick i'm like you know it's not gonna look real unless i'm talking about myself too and i just put all her business out everybody that she was talking about i put it out in the bio she found out that i um hacked her page because i guess i was the only person that she had gave her password to or whatever i didn't care i had moved what she was gonna do fight me i wanted to fight you anyway so i'd have been down what's good <laughs> that's pretty much how it ends she told people that it was me i think they asked me if it was me and i was like why would it be me like why would i talk about myself i'm so fake y'all <sighs> i'm sorry to my friends that i'm still friends with i lied about that situation i hacked amelia's account i did that i did it for y'all though because i like how she was talking about y'all so i put that out there period i don't know how millie's doing now but i did know that after i left the school she got jumped so, well, played out pretty fine to me. Yeah, feel free to like, subscribe, and comment. Check out my Instagram. And this is, yeah.